So, what's up guys? And thank you for joining for another video from me, Scarander. So, yeah. Croissant Mons is a part of the minigame now. Nah, not really. Nah. Yeah, but I really just wanted to talk about uh, the new mega post here. And uh, I do want to, um, you know, try to speak of them in a different way here. Um, it's just going to turn the one off. I hate, you know, doing like these unscripted ones because while I do this, it's basically just, you know, things want to start that doesn't, aren't supposed to start while I'm doing it. Um, let's see here. I'm actually going to go into more detail here. And we're going to watch this, guys. So obviously, they're all new Mega Pokes. Um, you guys already seen them. I can just show them fast if you haven't. I know you have. But yeah, this is the guys. Like, woo. And, um, you know, we want to stop Alteria. Alteria is getting that um, new fresh typing error and changing the way of its flying to a fair type. Being Doing that is going to make sure that it aren't any more weak to, um, obviously, its biggest counterpart, which is going to be that Dragon is super effective to it. No longer, which means that it's going to be great to know you against Laudios and Laudias. It's going to be specs to uh, uh, that dragon moves easily walling them out. And since you got that natural bulk, props probably going to be very, very well fitting there. And also, some new stallers to OU, yay! But did they did it, they did actually say that uh, it's going to be more bulky, and um, we're actually going to watch that if it's going to be more bulky here in the future. Um, we're just gonna watch the moves here. There's no reason for Moonblast anymore, obviously, because it's getting again pixelated. So much like Gardevoir, uh, every normal moves is now gonna be um, fair moves with a fair percent boost, and it learns the hyper voice by default, and that is really intimidating. Uh, or not default, egg move, obviously, but that can work in favor. But since they said it's gonna be more physical. I actually saw something that's going to blow a lot of minds here. This thing learns double edge, body slam, and secret power. The reason I choose to mention these things is obviously because body slam and secret power has the chance of paralyzation. Secret power works as uh, I think what is it, the floor uh, environment, which means that its after effect is paralyzation. Uh, since Altera isn't the fastest one around, even though it can learn Dragon Dance at level 34, if I remember correctly, um, it still can utilize this to, you know, before pre-building up. Plus it learns with a more Earthquake, which is a very, very good move. Have access to Dragon Claw if you want another, another type of um, stab there. You've got Dragon Rush, if you feel a little risky, you should not use that move at all. Also learns Pursuit, not bad actually, it can easily trap Laudios and Latias or Spectre Dragon or me Draco Meteor. You know, that is not a bad idea. Plus Roost. Roost is easily the superior move for it. Good way of recovering, it got the access to Cutting Guard. It's basically the same poke, but now it can actually do pretty nifty things. And I do looking forward to see this guy in um, the future tier. So let's talk about the Kossom Mens. Or uh, Mega Salamence. I like the design actually. I like the Crescent Moon as a wing. I don't know how it's fly. Like, no, but still, I, like I said, I like the design, so I give it that. It actually keeps its um, flying type and dragon uh, and gains air late. And I, I know you guys who have been following know what air late is, but I'm a douche, so I'm gonna explain it anyway. Air late is basically what Pixelate are, but with flying as its core and uh, getting that every normal move is now flying with a 30% boost. So, what can Flygon do? That is not a Flygon. Very much a Salamence. And what can Mega Salamence do? <clears throat> um, not too much, actually. It learns Double Edge by default, which is really good because it doesn't have any good flying type. I mean, learns fly by default. That that is very that is meta game stuff right there. But yeah, that is basically it. It learns dragon dance. It's still pretty much the basic same poke. But um, while doing this check, I learned it learns fresh. I had no idea about that. I didn't know fresh has one hundred twenty base power. 
I thought it was still 90, so, um, <laughs> wow. So, alright, so, so fresh is definitely a thing, but this guy also learns body slam, and you know what I think about paralyzation. Yeah, you, you want to have a body slam on your salamence here in the future. And if you want to go run it specially, Hyper Voice is very real, like, Salamence special attack is actually somewhat good, not too far off from its attack. Even though we can't utilize Moxie or Dragon Dance that perfectly with special attack, it still can pack somewhat of punch. You know, we got access to uh, Hydro Pump, or yeah, there it is, and Draco Meteor, and you got Heat Wave, Flame Forever. This guy can do it, like, he can be the guy. Plus, they said it's gonna be somewhat bulkier, so you can actually utilize Roots now in the future. Which I'm gonna look forward to. I hope this guy doesn't get to Uber. It's definitely a new type of wall breaker, and I do looking forward to seeing this in the future. But that is not the biggest news. The biggest news is Loop Honey. And I'm not kidding. I didn't play Gen 4, so I had no idea what this thing was about. Um, so I just realized, or while I'm watching it before that, that it's just your standard normal type with jump kick. And it learns high jump kick now, which. Seems very weird that it didn't do to begin with if you learned jump kick. But that goes with Soul Spike too. Like, what the hell? Why not? But let's go into detail. It gets scrappy now, which is really good. Uh, which means that both normal moves and fighting moves is Goat's type. Which means that normal and fighting, that combination now covers everything for neutral damage. Um, which, like I said, is very, very, very good. That means you don't have to fear too much when you're switching in uh, against an opponent. But... <laughs> <laughs> Still a playable bunny. <laughs> I love the pink one. Oh, I'm gonna make myself. Uh... <laughs> it's simply lovely. But yeah, uh, plus got splash. That is like OU stuff right there. But other than that, actually, it's the fault move pool is really, really bad. Like very, very bad. He learns dizzy punch and bounce. No, thank you. <laughs> he got the entertainment. I guess that's a thing. But the best thing about it was, and obviously, you know, Thunderbolt, Shadow Ball, Ice Beam, very good special offensive moves you want to run that. Um, it shouldn't do too bad, actually. But what I did find out was that this thing learned Cosmic Power. Like, help me, no way. So it learns Cosmic Power, and uh, as a tutor move, it actually have access to Drain Punch. Drain Punch! It can actually, you know... It can recover, it can boost itself up and recover. And that's not the worst part. I actually have a moveset now that I think could work rather well because it has access to secret power. So we get the paralyzation too, which can actually be somewhat of a really, really strong setup. I like it. I think it's horrible. Like, horribly strong. It can actually utilize the fake out last resort set too, uh, as Ivy Palm do in RU. Uh, I don't think that could be too bad if it gets some decent boost to its attack. It already have good special defenses or defenses and a very very good speed. And I probably just they probably gonna capitalize on that and boost it even further. And if that's the case, then fake out last assault is not a bad thing at all. Please make the seven to five year hundred and we're good to go. But I myself is going to use drain punch, power up punch, cosmic power, and secret power. I think that setup just might do it for me. That is some pretty darn good cover. And it, like, it learns Ice Punch, Thunder Punch, it learns Fia to Dance, which is not a bad move at all. And it learns Fire Punch, Double Hits. And it can learn Circle for, 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 for Force for force Switching. Damn. <laughs> but I, I already decided this thing is you stuff right there. I, yeah, I'm, I'm looking forward to this the most at the moment. But still, I can't forgive them. We still haven't seen a Mega Flygon or a Mega Tropius. Where are they? Um, but yeah, that is basically all for me. I hope you guys enjoyed this video. I um, hope it wasn't too long. Uh, if you guys saw something or something that I missed that you want me to... Uh, or just leave a comment, basically, and I respond to you directly. Uh, none of that, guys. Thank you, as always, for watching, and uh, have a good day. Alright, guys? Bye.